We're talking about knowledge of the future in movies, YouTube channel, Easter Egg Psychic. In this video, I'll take a look at actor John C. Riley. He was in several films by director Paul Thomas Anderson, including Hard Eight in 1996. This crime film had a cast that included Philip Baker Hall, Gwyneth Paltrow, Samuel L. Jackson, and Philip Seymour Hoffman. He was nominated for an Academy Award Best Supporting Actor for his part in the musical comedy crime film Chicago in 2002 based on the stage play. This featured Richard Gere, Renee Zellweger, and Catherine Zeta-Jones. He was in several comedy films, including Walk Hard, The Dewey Cox Story in 2007. This was a parody of several contemporary popular musician bio pictures such as Ray in 2004 and Walk the Line in 2005. The cast includes Kristen Wiig, Tim Meadows, Jenna Fisher, Jonah Hill, Harold Ramis. There were several musicians in this including Eddie Vedder, Jewel, Ghostface Killa. It was also in Talladega Nights, The Ballad of Ricky Bobby in 2006 with Will Ferrell. Also in this was Sacha Barra Cohen, Gary Cole, Michael Clark Duncan, and Amy Adams. So I took a look at John C. Riley. Not an easy actor to guess others whose looks could add up to match his. I thought he may resemble George C. Scott and Steve McQueen. A Connection is the 1956 drama Somebody Up There Likes Me. This film featured a large cast with Paul Newman, Pierre Angeli. There were several uncredited parts played by recognizable actors such as Lynn Lesser, Robert Loggia. George C. Scott played an uncredited prisoner. Steve McQueen also uncredited. He played Fidel. For Taipan in 1986... This was based on the James Colville novel set in the formative days of Hong Kong. Brian Brown, John Stanton, Kara Sedgwick, and Janine Turner were in this. In the early days, when the production started up, director Richard Fleischer was reportedly attached. They wanted Sean Connery to play Struan and George C. Scott as Tyler Brock. Steve McQueen was later signed as Struan for a then record salary. All right, connections. For Paul Thomas Anderson's Magnolia, Riley was in this. Anderson reportedly wrote the role of Earl Partridge for Jason Robards. This was the dying father of Tom Cruise's character. Robards initially could not appear in this. And it was offered to George C. Scott, who declined. Robards eventually appeared in the completed movie. Alternatively, I thought John C. Riley may resemble spy fiction author Tom Clancy or actor Tim Robbins. My YouTube channel is Easter Egg Psychic. There I go back and look at movies and television from the past. I analyze these for possible references to future media. These may appear in the form of anecdotes, idioms, anagrams, hidden in the subtext of the work in question. I also use an unconventional method where I look at the likenesses of the actors. And what I found is you can take the likenesses, match these up to some of the anecdotal items, and show past, present, and future information about actors and other personalities or may resemble the personalities in the movie or television episode that you're watching. My email contact is Easter Egg Guy, that's G U Y, at yahoo.com. Thanks for watching.